heard a ruckus downstairs a few minutes ago. Did something happen? I think I just heard someone fart. <laughs> did, you, did that come through all right? Oh, it did. No idea, but don't worry. Everything <laughs> above the 60th floor is safe. Hello, viewers. Well, spe speaking of viewers. Hi. Um, speaking of the viewers, hello. You know who you are. Do we know who you are? Comment and let us know. Exactly. Yep. If you want Couldn't to. Couldn't have said it better myself. All right, Shinra Tower here. Um, and we're busting in through the front door. Aye, because, do, do you know, the other way is funny. Because you're just, but you're just going up a hang. It would be the whole video because it's it is ridiculously long that yeah, you have to climb the stairs. Aye. Yeah. And this at least is a bit of action. Aye. And Tifa drops the R bomb in it, so we'll maybe just uh, ignore that one as well. The what? The R bomb. Did you not remember this? No. Aye. She drops an R bomb. What's so, an R bomb? Well, I'll let you. I'll let you. Um, I'll, I'll put it this way: it's no receptionist, but um. Aye, I'll let you. I'll let you guess that one. Excuse me. If 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 if, if you do, you need to have an appointment. And if you don't have an appointment, then you'll just have to well fuck off. I guess. No, you don't need no appointment. We're avalanche. <clears throat> Anyone who don't want their face bashed in better get the fuck out of here, man. <laughs> yeah. So uh, Laws just shouted through after hearing me ask that question. What is an R bomb? <laughs> <laughs> and she was uh, laughing in my face. Was you. <laughs> so, <laughs> Who do they think they are? Is 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 that that terrorist group Avalanche? Intruders seize them. There we go. Think so. Pretty cool area, this. Especially once yes. we get past these kind of um, initial floors and we get to the puzzle of finding the key cards and stuff. And it always stumps me. And I, I always never look yeah. it up. Cause it's quite fun just like running around and, you know, finding everything. Yeah, do you know the library puzzle? Oh, I used to. Oh. Uh, I used it's to. Fucking or, or do you mean, tough. do I know all of it or do I know no, the No, yeah, like how you do it. How you work yeah. it out. Yep. Well, I'll get there. Hmm. I, is that that's not the one with the map, is it? No, that's a no, different that's, one. That's a different puzzle, yeah. Um, that's not really a right. puzzle. That's a a, a chore. Yeah, we, but it's just like a jigsaw, isn't it? Uh, um, right, we'll get we'll get to the library puzzle and I'll, uh, I'll try and remember it. Okay. Or um, you know we might not in this video. I can't remember how quickly. No, uh, uh, this could take a while. Let's turn up the elevator. Let's get some healing. Yep. I was tempted with a tent, but I decided against it. <laughs> You'll never use a tent in this whole <laughs> run through. Yeah, I thought you could go in these. That's technically the elevator. He, he did say the elevator, but nope, I have to find another way up. So it's yeah. actually up the stairs, isn't it? I'm glad they brought this music back for this one. For yeah. this particular scene. It's so good. I'm yeah. not sure, does this... Does this get played again? Uh, this music? Yeah. Good question. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, pretty sure it does. I'm just gonna check that we're not supposed to have lost sound there. Can never tell with this bloody thing. No, it's no. No, there's much going on with the sound. But yeah. there we go. Ah, it may just have been silent. Get that fucking cursor off my screen. <laughs> this time they will think you're mad. <laughs> this yeah. time they will think it. <laughs> What's wrong? <laughs> Cursors. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't want to start trouble until we saved Aerith. I should have known that was going to be impossible, though. <laughs> what is it? You're giving me the willies. So there's so there's times when you will fight. F so so there's times when even you will fight for <laughs> other people. Mind your own business. You know I ain't so good at saying this, but sorry for a lot of things. What the fuck? Look! Damn! This doesn't actually make any sense, because this lift would couldn't be going to all these floors. <laughs> Just stop a cloud, doesn't matter where. <laughs> like, what's going on here, technically? Imagine, yeah, you would technically be hitting the, the ceiling floor. You'd be dead. You'd be dead. Yeah, you would be dead. Or at least have a mild concussion. Aye. 19. Aye, this, yeah. is, this is random. This could be, mm. you could get this, I think it, I don't think it always 19, I think it, it, you get a chance of a number and you get higher and higher. 
Yeah, but it's not. You couldn't get to the finale in one. It's no, random no, no. within yeah, a yeah, range. Yeah. Aye. Yeah. Oh. Um, you pro oh, okay. I was about to think about morphing again, but I won't bother. Mm -hmm. Now, in the original, there are enemies here that get you incredibly good gear if you steal from them, but I've got no idea if that's in hard mode. Yeah, true. I'm starting to think that the that hard mode doesn't have any extra stuff other than that one boss <laughs> that that's... they flung in at the beginning to make you think, oh, look at hard mode. Aye, in the rest great. of the game, you're and like, it... oh my god, what are they going to throw in next? Yeah, and it's actually simply just inflated HP numbers. And I mean, they did technically say that. I mean, that's what they originally promised. Aye, but then they, 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 they threw an boss extra in. boss. Why don't they just not put the boss in and make us just, you know, not expect anything? Sorry, mod creators. Aye. Know, I know you work hard and stuff, but... Are we being like those guys complaining about someone doing a good thing for us? Aye. <laughs> this, this, 21st this century man. Right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I know, I enjoy the little, although I'm not really using them, I enjoy the little things that they've added to the characters. Like, I'm just going to defend. Oh, look, I wonder if that would. Oh, it didn't. Do you remember what Cloud Thing was? No. <laughs> if he defends, he has a chance to counter-attack. Right. But like with some really good moves. Right, okay. Yeah, yeah, So I was hoping he would do it from- Oh, there! Hi. Look at that. Right, okay. Great. I should be using that a lot, but i am not been doing it. And Tifa's has only happened once, where if she dies, she um, comes back to life with one HP. Oh, yeah, because you've not really been close to dying, really. Nah. This. Maybe, do you know, maybe this is really hard, but I'm just too good. I think, we have, I think we have to, you know... Yeah, accept that possibility. Yeah, exactly. Maiden's Grace. Sounds like something we could sell. No. Or sit at to rest. <laughs> yeah, exactly. There we go. There's a wee bit coming up that I always liked, and there's a wee thing, I don't know, I'm going to wait and see if you know about it. You know the bit where you have to run and hide behind the statues? Yes. Do you know what happens if you, like, have you ever just failed that a million times on purpose? I'm starting to think that the that hard mode doesn't have any extra stuff other than that one boss. Oh, this is new. No, um, so uh, get no, up, you. Times. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Immediately <laughs> eating words here. Yeah. <laughs> You've got a wee bag. Oh, great. Aye, maybe, got... uh, maybe I should be complaining more, and then Aye. we'll get more stuff. Have we Aye. played this for seven hours already? That's well, nuts. sometimes it's on like I'm waiting for you for a f maybe 10, 20 minutes. You know, that isn't me like <laughs> <laughs> calling you. Complaining or about my timekeeping. No. <laughs> but anyway, uh, you've got a wee bag of egg there. <laughs> yeah. On my on my face. Destroy you sure? the Destroy the, the intruders. This this the boss. guards were there. Aye, but this big monster thing is definitely. But is it just there. another scorpion? <laughs> oh, and two robot men. Just so uh, uh okay, oh, cool. Aye. Alright, keep your wits about you here. This is maybe gonna be the hardest fight so far. Hopefully these two guys, these guys might die in about one hit. Yeah. Unless they're like bossmen. <laughs> yeah, Harvey Bossman. <laughs> Is that funny to MD Buzz? No. <laughs> Probably not, man. I don't know what like yeah. It's hard it's to do. Same thing when you <laughs> like baldy moustache or something. So my guess is we're gonna get to the harbour. Or we're gonna get near the harbour. And then old Oh, the moustache or something's gonna be Wait. like around. <laughs> the village. There's something wrong with the sea. The land is gone. It's me. No, I would buy that, yeah. I did this. The rat's Baldy moustache or something. I did it. No, the Count and Countess did. Let's go. Let's just go. <laughs> oh, goodness. The tremors brought those bloody eggs out in the open. Yes, they're still here. Always. 
<laughs> See, for the sake of the video, I'm trying to disguise too much of laugh. The phrase. <laughs> Baldy Miss Fasherson. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh. I'm crying, honestly. <laughs> it's so hilariously funny to me. Uh, but, uh, you know. Nope. <laughs> <I don't> know. <laughs> Who knows? It's hard to gauge these things. Uh, but, in a way, like, you know, as much as we enjoy putting stuff out and, like, talking to viewers and stuff, we'd okay. almost be doing this anyway. <laughs> and just yes. talking shit over it. So, there's no point in, uh, Worrying about if folk, aye, aye, folk might find it funny and they might know, but and actually who cares? Oh, here we go, right, I went two years for the first time. Yes! No, you got one miss. <laughs> what? Oh, no, is it only, is it only the middle one? Aye, it's the middle one. What matters? Aye, really? or do you I know that? I don't know. I always thought it was all three. See, it's funny, like, see, just the... The stuff you have in your head about these games. Unless that's true and I've been wrong my entire life, but. No, but know. who knows? But there's been. There'll be other things. Like, yeah. there's just. Yeah. Those wee kind of things that you just had in your head. Yeah. Because I guess in normal slots, it's only the main bit, isn't it? Oh, I've done that. Mm -hmm. Bad timing. Mm. This could be. Imagine this is like one shot. Terrible, is it? No, oh, I Oh, and it's oh, every well. day as well. Ooh. Oh, it's ugly, but it's no. Aye, danger this plus. is danger though, because oh, that was... yeah, so it is. Yep. So Tifa... Oh no, no but... we're alright. We're alright. Yeah, that was lucky, yeah. That could be bad though. <sighs> oh, that missed what? Tifa, that was lucky. Oh yeah, it did. That was just a normal attack though. If she dies, she might come up with 1 HP Aye, as well. Aye, so. so that's alright. Yeah. I really feel like, see if you put Cure and All on Tifa, you'd basically be unkillable. Aye. Does that like work? Her... Yeah, yeah, but I really like all in both the now. I'd be I quite, know, um... Uh, let's do a wee steal, actually. Why am mm -hmm. I doing this? I know I know what happens. Why am I doing this? Because you can hit the tail. Oh! Never seen that move in my whole life. Nope. Oh, the tail's back down anyway. Yep, go for it. Getting a wee limit break finisher? Nope. Mm. Go on, Tifa. Uh, oh, that's bad. Oh, harsh. Yep. It goes so fast, like there's no rhyme or reason to to that. No. I think you can you can sp you can technically uh, f like f uh, what am I trying to say? You can kind of shenagle it uh, <laughs> <laughs> by like poison, I think. Like you can oh, like right. keep because that's how folk break the game way Kate Sith's uh, limit break. Right. Okay. The slots. Yeah. So did you know this? I'm sure you did, but you know, just for the sake of conversation, um, that seeing um, speedruns of this game, mm -hmm. they they manipulate the RNG of the whole game. Yeah. The by step counters. Step counters. Yeah, oh, it's me mental. Yeah. So they like they count up all of their steps and literally like cloud stepping in the world, they count them. Mm. Or maybe they don't count them, but it's more like you can have remember paths or routes or whatever. But somebody did count them to come up with these strategies. And the way that that works is that when it, it's actually, for some reason, steps that manipulate random encounter RNG. Mm. Nice, by the way. Thank you. That was a tough fight. Um, so the, the speedrunners are actually counting steps, just yeah. like your average person with a, you know, Fitbit. Aye. There's a mental one as well where um, I'll probably point this out when we play 8. But see, speedrunners want to get the Zell card, right? Because you can refine that into something like really helpful for that point in the game. But um, that's a pure, it's it's so random. Oh, weapon. Whether, or, whether or not, um, oh, yeah, we card. What's well. this? Oops, sorry, that was a bit fast. Um, so it's it's random when the person Zell's more plays the Zell card, right? Mm -hmm. I'll I'll do this, mate. I'll do this. Look at this. Ten. Yeah. Yes. I'm growing. Yeah. That's just a righteous sight. Everybody at full health and full HP and full MP. Aye. Health so, and HP are the same <clears> thing. <throat> yes. Yeah. Um. So there's a weird thing with the Zell card where. People could tell what like seed like so the game is done by like seeds I guess where like in one seed the Zell card will come at this time and our time it might take this so 
the, when they're on the train, and we're talking fucking at a different point of the game entirely, there's a train going by and they count the number of times they see like lampposts passing in the window and that tells them what seed they're on and that'll help get the Zell card later on in the game. <laughs> it's just nuts. Jesus Christ. But I think folk have now developed like programs for it so they input stuff that they see and it and the program will calculate it for them. Hmm. This is the real I... thing. Don't let your guard down. Sorry for interrupting you. No, is that cheating though? No. Well, no. aye, aye. Aye, that's... Well... Hey, I'm not going to tell a speedrunner how to do his job, I'll be honest. <laughs> well, yeah. I hope Eris is alright. But you do get loads of different categories of speedrun in every game. You get glitchless and all that, don't you? Yeah. Aye, any percents and all that. Yeah. Is it going to be good graphics? Oh, it is. Nice. <laughs> yep, the mod didn't quite make it to that sleeping guard there. Hmm. Oh, all these two. Yeah, yeah they just it. look the same as ever. No, they look so worse. This is a sta <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe just in comparison, though. Eh? You kind don't belong. You're going, you get away here. That's the one I'm talking about. So, yeah. So if you, what happens if you fail it a million times? So every time you fail it, you get into a fight, right? And you come back here and you have to do the same thing over and over and over again. And eventually you just literally kill all the guards and you don't have to do the minigame anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Great. Look at all them guards running around out there. Cloud, you go first and signal us when it's safe to move. It's funny when games do weird things like this, like we've just killed about a million guards already. Why are we, why are we <laughs> yeah. bother, bothering with this at all? Yeah. It's the classic one of uh, in Grand Theft Auto 4, where Nico, you know, complains that he doesn't want to kill anyone anymore, and then <laughs> the minute you get control, you just go on a slaughtering spree. Aye. Yeah. There was a kind of journalism-y term for that back in, you know, 2015 when games writing was coming out. It's uh, mm. ludonarrative dissonance. Mm -hmm. You heard of this? I've heard the word now that you said it, but I was trying to guess what the word was going to be before you said, oh. So and it means then... when the, the story conflicts with the gameplay. Yeah. Like, the story they're trying to tell conflicts with the gameplay that is necessary. So, like, Nico saying that he's, you know, all zen and he's fucking, like, mm -hmm. you know, he doesn't want to harm a fly, and then you just go out and absolutely annihilate everyone in New York City. Oh! Yeah, I'm lucky. How to time it. Um, I find the Elder Scrolls game after Morrowind was really bad for that, because their main story was like, the world is ending, you better go and do this, and then no one ever did it. Yeah, it's exactly. it's kind of like um, The Witcher 3. Mm. Go and find Siri, it's absolutely urgent. Oh, but, you know, <laughs> let's go and do some other shit Aye. as well. 50 hours and later. Fallout 4 was kind of bad for that. Sky That's what Skyrim was really great at. It was just like, yeah, like there's, there is some stakes, sure, but <laughs> it's not that bad. Well, you know? Have we spoke about Starfield? We've mentioned that we were kind of like... I think we mentioned it maybe on the side quest thing. It's like, I just don't know what to think about that company anymore. I just yeah. don't know if it's going to be good or not. I know, because we've already had two disappointing releases this year. From the, I mean, I haven't played them, but from the point of view of the reception, the Star Wars Survivor is good, but the performance is atrocious. And then Redfall is both performance atrocious and awful. Yeah. What the hell are you doing, man? we got to do it again. Fuck. Those Barrett's slow as fuck. I felt like I had to, like, proper mm -hmm. time it. I know, you're as... Aye. It's the two guys at the end is... Uh, at the... Aye. Um, right side are faster, eh? Aye. So you're as well just waiting on the easy one. I know you're kind of gallusing it with the... <laughs> swap places one. Hey, it was working. Until it did. It was working, yeah. Bye. Would you think of Starfield? I don't know, man. It's always kind of nice to, you know, I'm always going to sit up and pay attention when you kind of, like... <gasps> oh, I'm a dear! <laughs> Come on, to fuck. Um, <laughs> like a new Bethesda game, you know, because, like, yeah. Oblivion was the first one I played. To be Aye. honest, you played Morrowind mm. before I played any of them, but Oblivion was just such a fucking game changer, man. And the thing is, it's pretty dated now. I, I tried Aye. going back and playing it, and it's just, like... It is good, but you can 
<laughs> you know, you can see the, the seams. Aye. And, um, uh, man, whatever they did with the faces for that one was, yeah. for the, and again, the, or the NPCs was, like, harrowing at times. Yeah. Have you seen that video, or you might have even found them in the game, but I've actually never found them, where there is somebody with a voice actor says, uh, they give they give their line, but then they actually left in when the voice actor says, oh, let me do that again. <laughs> <laughs> have you seen that? No. Like, they still in the game, you can go and find but, that person when the voice actor says to the producer or whatever. Well, see if you ever uh, wonder, like, I can't remember if it was Oblivion or Skyrim, or maybe even both, but see if you ever think the dialogue's a bit, like, disjointed. It's because, see the voice actors? They just apparently recorded every single one of their lines in one take. <laughs> so, like, there was no waiting for the other person to talk her in. It was just literally they would say all their things and they weren't reacting to anything. So they yeah. didn't know what, like, the context they're in. So it just, it just feels pretty yeah. shit. What the hell are you doing, man? We got to go. So, yeah, st- one thing that I, I would have thought Starfield would have been an easy one for Bethesda to make, but then I started getting worried when they said that there's over a thousand planets. Yeah. Aye. It's like, how can you possibly have over a thousand planets and have meaningful shit on all of them? Yeah. So I, mean, I think one of the best things they could do is have it be like three or four planets that actually have really, really great places. And then the rest of the world is kind of like your chalice dungeons. Mm-hmm. For anyone who's bloodborne savvy, you'll know that that's just your like infinite fun land. You just or, go um, there and you can beat up people forever kind of thing. Aye. Quote unquote fun, because I didn't quite like them if I'm being honest. No, the Chalice Dungeon's one of the, my favourite part of of Bloodborne. Oh. Um so Um I do you know a kinda annoying trend in gaming now is like AAA folk wanting to do procedural generated things. Where I kinda feel oh, yep, there you go. Got it, nice. Where like that's that's what you mean. You ca- can you make like them trying to do a Skyrim thing with all these planets? That must mean to a degree they must be like procedurally generated. But then you are, ooh. but then you are losing things because they're not handcrafting like thing like a planet. If they just made I don't know fifteen planets that they've properly just handcrafted, placed every single thing there to add to, oh, I'm skipping things, sorry, uh, you know, that would be better. And it's the same way, like, No Man's Sky tried it with these planets, there's a million of them, and how many are, like, unique or actually get anything to do? Well, when it first came out, zero. Yeah, it's, it's supposed to be better now, but... Yeah. Yeah. Remember, we're here to see Aerith, whatever you said there, Barak, so I didn't actually hear you. <laughs> Yeah, I'd <laughs> there. Yeah, there we go. That's the hardest yeah. part of the whole place. Done for yours, by the way. Aye, yeah. I mean, other than trying to find the key cards, but if you know where they are, I, then... I always you're... thought it was a bit mental that there's obviously been a high alert. The whole building really should have been aware of these intruders, but these folk yeah. are no bothered. No, not in the slightest. Maybe that's just a symptom of elite corporatism. Yeah, true. They just think, you know, that's a downstairs problem. Oh, I don't remember seeing your face. <laughs> you knew him? I say, you're cute. <laughs> Let me teach you some things. <laughs> things? <laughs> Wipe that stupid look off your face. I was only going to tell you where everything is around here. Right now, you're in the lounge on 61. Above us is Mayor Domino's office on 62. But that guy's all washed up. He has no administrative power anymore. On 63 is a warehouse for supplies. 64 is our personal gym for exercise. 65 is our diorama room. And there's a huge skill model of the Midgar. Beyond that is 66th floor where the Xquiz hold conferences. 67 and 68 are both used by the science team for, um, well... And finally there's floor 69 which is admin security for the president, who has his office above on the final floor of Junior HQ. <laughs> <laughs> the same floor I would choose if I was the boss of a company. <laughs> But keep this to yourself. I'm going to tell you some gossip. Don't tell anyone where you got this from, newbie. Or does the higher ups recently reopen plans to develop a new city somewhere new Midgard of the gold? I don't think this person gave us all this info last time, did you? In the real thing, did you? 
Can't Maybe remember. she does. No one down here knows why they're starting up again, but there's rumours that Mako output has been dwindling. There's also this talk something new to build Neo Midgar was found recently. I guess that's another reason. What all boils down to is going where the money is. Now's the time to go into the urban development department. Oh shit, I have to go. Gotta get back to work. Fuck me, I thought she gave me the key card. What's well, keeping her? Did, did she forget her key card? Can't, can't get your different floors with the key card. Hello, you. What are you doing here? Oh. <laughs> Yeah, you're busted. I know exactly who you guys are. You're the Shinra Inc. Repair Division. You know this building is ready to fall apart. No wonder if you guys are miners. The door there was pushed open. You had to fix it real way. Well, yeah, I guess you better look at the other floors too. Here, take my key card. <laughs> yeah, right, that was easy. Let me talk cool. to some folks. Aye, right, why not? Uh, pads out the story. I heard a ruckus downstairs a few minutes ago. Did something happen? I think I just heard someone fart. <laughs> <laughs> did, you, did that come through all right? Oh, it did. No idea, but don't worry. Everything <laughs> above the sexier floor is safe. I just farted. Hope no one heard. <laughs> is this the same dialogue? Oh, it is. Okay. There's a big tree in this place. There is a big tree in this place. Yeah. Sorry. Weird. Yeah, strange. Oh, here we are. Okay. Could speak to the mayor first, I suppose. How do you do? This is the office of Mutger's mayor, the mayor of the middle, as in his office. I'm the deputy mayor. If you should have any questions, feel free to ask me. Okay. Hmm. Oh, and her maturity. Oh, you almost say that I'm Hermy. I'm Dermot, the mayor of Midgar. Well, actually, I'm mayor in name only, the city, and everything is now at the run by the Shinra Incorporate. My only real job these days is watching over Shinra's research documents. I oh, you can't imagine how humiliating it is to be treated like a librarian. Actually, you want to get upstairs? I'll tell you what, if you can guess the password, I'll give you my key card. Yes, that's right, guess the beat bear bear down you give you my key card. Get on the first try and even with a special material, cause why not? Yeah, we want that. I so I can't remember what the options are. Can we check the options without committing oh, to a choice? It's random. Oh. Uh-huh. You we got it. Then tell me. So it right, can okay. be any what I'm else? not sure if it can be any. But it's been Hojo before, I'm sure it's been Mako, and I think it's even been Bomber King before, so maybe it is all of them. Right, okay, so wait a second, let's go and find it out there now. Do you have any recollection how you do it? Yeah, so you need to check the yellow bit at the front. Mm -hmm. Urban Development Research Library, what? What is this again? <laughs> That's a dear Urban... <laughs> No, I can't. I'm trying my best. Check the other uh, one just to... Oh, well, I'll, give... you... I'll try and, like, remind you. Without yeah. saying in, so it's urban development, right? Yeah. Okay. Number two, problems with plate construction in Midgar. Number eight, new plans for urban planning. Oh. Number four, Midgar city map sectors zero to four. Number one, biological characteristics in the Ancientes. Right, that's it. Okay. That's it there. Right, because it's the one that doesn't belong yes. in its category. So yeah. that means that number one is B. But it must be makes, bomb then, isn't it? It must be bomb. Aye. Yeah. Right. There was cool. no other Bs, was there? Yeah, no. Let's just but that's the, only, that's the only one that didn't belong in yeah. urban planning. Let's just double you know, check. Yeah, we'll, we'll confirm, eh? Aye, confirm. So, Science Division Research Library. Data on experimental organisms living in Midgar area report 7. Why is that number 6? Mm, number 4, the Genova Project. File on Dr. Gast, biologist, Earth's father. Spoilers. Sorry. Ancients in history. Wait. But that's 14, so it can't be that. Reactor construction chart. But this doesn't feel like it should be an either. They'll be wrong. Hmm. 
Right, oh no, that's science, isn't it? Wait, what was the what was the MCLOD? Science. Aye, that is science reactors, isn't it? Yeah. But there was that 14 seemed a bit off. The ancients in history, yeah, I suppose so. But it's 14, so... Or maybe, it, wait. Is it maybe just the letters? Like, T. Well, the 14th letter in that is H. Oh, is that how it works? So it's 1, 2, 3, 4. Space so count? is there a word that has... The space count? Like a space? Well, I didn't, I didn't count. One, two, three, three, four, five, six, seven, you get one, two, three, it would be T. I got I there. <laughs> Let's try that again. Yeah, one, two, four, three, five, four, five, six, seven, eight, 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 seven
Right, okay. Level B employee verified. You are permitted to open doors on this floor up to three times. Bleep. If you receive an item coupon, return to exchange it for an item. Wording, do not enter the air conditioning ducts. They are very dangerous. Right, wait a minute. Yes? Is that an episode of gaming? Oh, hey. Let me check. Because it, it feels... 36 minutes? Ah, it definitely is. Yeah. Right, feels. So, we're making our way up. By the way, we do have a musical shout from... Oh, yes. ...friend of the show, Max. The album, Dougie will put it up on the screen right now, is Currents by Tame Impala. Yep. Max recommended this, but me and Dougie actually have listened to this quite a lot. Yep. Great album. Yep, pretty good. Yep. Good show. Let it remember, viewers, you have your chance to get your favourite album on screen, but you, have to, <laughs> but you have to comment first. I'm sorry, it's just how it is. Yep, exactly. Oh well, cheerio. Bye-bye.